Depending on where you are, your yard may be covered in these special cicadas. Tammy Hayes sent us a photo from South Knoxville. Yeah, that's Brood X. Dozens of those Brood 10 cicadas covering trees and plants. Even if you don't see them, perhaps you're hearing them. Yes, indeed. That is the sound in Louisville in Blunt County. Thanks to Bo Nicely for sending us that video. Cicadas are about the same decibel as a lawnmower, but some are wondering if their yard will ever look like this. The answer is if you don't see the brood 10 cicadas in your yard by mid June, you probably won't see them in your yard. If your neighborhood though looks like this, you will see lots of shells left behind after those cicadas are gone. Well, the, the brown, the brown cast skins or shells that are left behind, they, they cause no issues whatsoever. They will eventually degrade and go back to, to nutrients that can be used by, uh, by other organisms. If you'd like to, you can go around and pick them off if they're unsightly to you and throw them in a compost pile or something like that. Or talk to Todd. I think they taste like popcorn or something. Uh, yeah, fried okra. Thank you, Todd. Experts say this generation of brood 10 cicadas will begin dying off in late June, and then their offspring will go underground again for 17 years. We'd still like to see your cicada photos. You can text them to us at 865-637-1010. Right now on the WBIR YouTube page, you can see both Robin, Todd, Beth, and JB eat a cicada. You didn't eat one? You ate one on uh, social media, I saw. Oh, I did? Yeah. Okay. Oh, <laughs> I did, I guess. <laughs> Calling us out here.